Hello and welcome back to my channel, Plants with Amanda. In this video, we're decorating my vertical catch-all happy planner for this week. We're gonna be doing a Halloween spread. Uh, we've got one more week left of Halloween spreads. Tuesday is Halloween, so I thought we would go ahead and do one more. Well, actually maybe two more because I think I might be doing a Halloween in my mini also, but we'll see, we'll, we'll get to that in another video. So we're gonna be using stickers from Whimsy Lux, A Year of Planning, Volume Two. There are a set, there is a set of Halloween stickers in the sticker book that's really cute. It's got boxes and everything to match. So we've got these stickers and these boxes. So we're gonna keep this pretty simple today and hopefully make it a pretty quick spread. I've got a lot of videos I'm wanting to film um, to get out to you guys, and I wanna try to get ahead on filming, and so that's why I'm gonna try to make it a quick, a quick spread. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. I uh, wanna start with the boxes. I'll tell you what, let's do, I was gonna do green, but let's do orange on Halloween. And then we'll bring in a black box. on Wednesday. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and do a cluster over on Sunday as well. I think this sticker book is still available. It's um, by Whimsy Lux, as I mentioned before. Uh, she has own, she has more sticker sheets than sticker books. She's got two sticker books. This one, volume, it's um, a year of planning, volume one and volume two. Uh, they're really cute sticker books. I love the style and the artwork that she uses, and then um, the boxes that match. And the only thing that you have to kind of find is bullet points if you want. If you want bullet points, they're not in the sticker book, but they're really, really cute. The, the artwork's really, uh, really cute as well. And um, I've never gotten sticker sheets from Whimsy Lux, but I've gotten the sticker books. And I'm hoping that she comes out with another one for 2024. These last two were over the last couple of years, um, I think. So let's do a little cluster down here and maybe one up here. I just figured today I would just go in with the boxes. It just kind of helps to get things set in the spread. And, um, and then you can just kind of decorate around them. Okay, let's do a little green box with these. Okay, I think that's pretty good. Let's go in with, I think the, the little banner would be cute for right over, like on Halloween. I mean, it's gonna be a full Halloween spread. Last year I did a um, uh, kind of a fall Halloween, like it was Halloween here, cause Halloween was on a Monday and then I did fall, but, and it was really cute, it was a Mickey Mouse spread. Um, and I couldn't decide this year what I wanted to do, but um, I'm, I kind of just thought I liked these stickers. I wanted to use them, so I thought let's just do a full-on Halloween spread. This is really cute too. I could have used that there. Actually, we'll just put it here. That's really cute. Uh, let's take the spider web. Put it right up here and then we're going to bring the little spider in down kind of from it kind of like that and then i'll use my washi cutter and draw a line i think i'm going to use a washi or excuse me <laughs> a muji uh 3.38 tip because this is a really um fine tip and it'll be thinner line than what I've been using on my little spider webs that's really cute 
Okay. Let's trim that off just a smidge on the edge there. Let's bring in the boo since I've got a little quote here and a little quote there. We'll bring this one in, figure out where we're going to put it. I kind of liked it here, but I don't like the boo on this page twice. Maybe we'll bring it down here. Uh, before I put a lot of decorative stickers in, let's put some bullet points in. Let's. I've got, I've got a, my bullet point sticker book here. It's just like a little DIY sticker book from the Happy Planner, and I pull out a bunch of bullet points from different sticker books. And most recently, I got the I Heart Stickers uh, sticker book, and I've put this sheet in here. So I've got some orange ones that are a good size. I like that they made these a lot smaller. So we're going to go ahead and use these. Let's do some on Monday. Do some on Wednesday. Let's go, let's go ahead and put some on Saturday. I'm going to bring that one down just a little bit. That way I can fit my little header sticker in there if I do use those. All right. Maybe we could put a couple here on Thursday. All right. That's good. Okay, now we can decorate with the with the cute little stickers here. Got our little trick or treat bag and our ghost. I thought maybe they could go together. And then Hocus Pocus with a little witch hat would be cute. Gotta have the pumpkin. This is coming together really quickly, you guys. It's so cute. I do want to put the little caramel apple on here because it's got the green and kind of ties in those green boxes. So we'll put that down here on Sunday. How cute. And what else? Something here. Now, I don't really want the moon, I don't think, down that far. I would put the moon at the top if I was going to use the moon. What about the bat? I'm trying to cover up this, um, this week's list. So, that's cute. Okay, all right, let's go in with some word stickers. The ones that I print and then cut out on my Cricut. Put a get it done up here. Important. And then we'll do to do down here. OK, 
Okay, I think I'm done. That was a really fast spread. I should have um, timed myself, but that's okay. We're right at 11 minutes. Depends on how much I cut out. Probably not much. Um, but yeah, here's our spread for this week using A Year of Planning Volume 2 from Whimsy Lux. I think this is available. If it is, I will link it down below for you guys. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I hope you like the spread in the video. If you do, go ahead and hit that thumbs up. We'll see you next time. Bye.